Think twice before you buy a pump for your rainwater tank. I'm Bernie Omedy from Measured Irrigation. This video will explain why buying a pump for your rainwater tank may be a waste of money. Suppose you walk into your local irrigation supplier and say that you would like to irrigate your garden using a rainwater tank. One of the first issues raised will be the choice of a suitable pump. The cost of the recommended pump is likely to be at least $400. For example, the bottom of the range Bianco pump is a 450 watt pump and costs about $400. If you have level ground, there is a much simpler way to irrigate your garden from your rainwater tank without using a pump. The cost of the irrigation controller and the solenoid valve will be much less than the cost of a pump. The irrigation system uses gravity feed and can deliver water to at least 500 2 litre per hour drippers. You will need the following products from measured irrigation. A terracotta irrigation controller with booster, $233, and a high flow, zero pressure, 12 volt solenoid valve, $99. As well as being cheaper, measured irrigation uses less water. Here are some of the advantages. The water supply pressure can be as low as one meter head. Non-pressure compensating drippers are cheaper and more reliable than pressure compensating drippers. The booster allows the volume of water discharged by each dripper to be set to any value between 250 mils and 1,800 mils. The volume of water discharged by each dripper is independent of the water supply pressure. This is not the case with any other irrigation system. The irrigation frequency responds automatically to on-site evaporation and rainfall. A conventional smart irrigation controller cannot do this. If the on-site evaporation rate doubles during a heat wave, the irrigation frequency doubles automatically. A light sensor provides the option of irrigating at night time only. Water in the terracotta pot and the booster is protected from debris, algae, mosquitoes and thirsty animals. Simple and low tech and therefore fewer things can go wrong. You can leave your irrigation application unattended for months on end. I live in Adelaide where I'm using measured irrigation from a rainwater tank to irrigate my garden with about 500 2 litre per hour drippers. My water supply is a rainwater header tank with a maximum head of 1.4 metres above the drippers. Even though some of the drippers are more than 70 metres from the header tank, the pressure at the drippers is always more than 1.1 metres head. Using one irrigation dripper as the control dripper, I have adjusted the flow inside the terracotta pot to ensure that one litre of water is discharged by each dripper during the irrigation. During winter months in Adelaide, rainfall often exceeds evaporation. For these periods, the irrigation stops automatically. Measured irrigation is incredibly simple and inexpensive, so think twice before you buy a pump for your rainwater tank. For more information, or to place an order, go to the Measured Irrigation website.